Didn't mean to scare you guys. Today we're going to be having a look at another BAM box. I believe this BAM box is for February, and I believe this also is the original BAM box, as indicated by the fact that there is no horror BAM box up at the top corner. BAM box every single month. Let me break it down for you. Give you the 411 BAM box every single month gives you collectibles, but more importantly, gives you autographs. It's one of the few subscription services on the market that delivers to you every single month a collection of signatures. Signatures. And some of the more notable signatures that I've gotten through the BAM box, uh, one of my favorite, I think, was Daniel LaRusso. That's not actually his real name, but Pat, I think it was Pat Morita. No, Pat Morita played Mr. Miyagi. What was his real name? Got an autograph of him. That was pretty cool. That's one of my all-time favorites. But got a whole bunch of different autographs. All coming to us from the folks over at Bambox. Name's going to come to me at some point. Ralph Macchio. Ralph Macchio. That's right. All right, so let's go ahead and get that opened up. One of my all-time favorites. Also, I, one of my all-time favorite movies, Karate Kid. Anybody else really excited for the new Karate Kid TV series? I think it's called Cobra Kai. It's coming to, I believe, specifically. I'm doing a lot of I believes in this video. I think it's coming to uh, a YouTube streaming. I don't know how that's going to work, but I'm really excited for that. I hope it doesn't water down the original trilogy, because there were three Karate Kids. I completely... I don't even think about the next Karate Kid. Hillary Swank. I don't, I don't know what, what was happening there. Anyways, we're going to move the tissue paper out of the way. I don't need that. Do you need that? I don't. So, move it aside. I noticed that we've got ourselves a pin or a badge, like an ID badge. It's got a little clip at the top. I don't know what it's for, but we're going to flip it around. And we've got Agent Dana Scully. Somewhat ironic because I seem to think a lot of seams, I believes and seams, kind of, sort of, kind of, sort of. Uh, I believe we over already gotten a Fox Mulder ID badge. I'm going to have to see if I can find that somewhere. Now I've got Agent Dana Scully. That's very cool. I, can, I need to def desperately find my Fox Mulder, and then I'll have the pair. Maybe I'll just wear this into work one day. <laughs> I'll just voluntarily show it to somebody. Don't worry, I, I got my badge. Sorry, does that say FBI? It does. Sorry, does that also say Data Scully? Yes, it does. Does it also have a picture of a woman on it? Yes. Somebody probably would immediately tell me, I don't believe three things are correct according to your badge. And I would probably ask, which one do you find is the least believable? Uh, we also got, oh, got a little Skynet uh, CPU chip. I don't know what the actual... It's not the personality chip. It's the chip that Miles Dyson has. Although it's not quite gold, it's kind of more of a reddish color. But it is metal though, that's pretty cool. And then of course we've got some autographs. We've got Hark, I do believe we've got three different autographs. The first one being Black Panther. And this is out of 2,000 copies. This is number 1325, complete with signature down below. Uh, let's see here. This BAM original box fan art collection with art print Wakanda has been hand signed by artist Kyle Willis and is guaranteed to be authentic. Very nice. I love how it's also got the comic panels in the background there. Find a place to put that up. Autograph number two. We've got Harley Quinn. This one's out of 2,000 copies. This is 543. And the signature is up at the... Oh, actually, the signature is right on the side here. And this one is... It says, The BAM Original Box Fan Art Collection Legacy Art Print Harley Girl has been hand-signed by artist Nathan Swerdy, and it's guaranteed to be authentic. And lastly, this is... Oh! Um, of course, I could look on the back to find out the actress's name. This 8x10 photo from Smallville has been hand-signed by Lore Vandervoort, which actually, funny enough, it's really only funny for myself, I'm sure, until I tell you guys the story, and you probably won't even find that funny. Uh, Lore Vandervoort, Vandervoort was also in the recent Jigsaw movie, and I just watched it 
watched it while I was off sick. I might even sound like I'm still a little bit sick, but I was off sick for about four days from work. And during that time, I, bin, I binge watched probably a good 15 movies. Some were good, some were bad. Uh, and then one of the one one of the ones I watched was Jigsaw. I actually thought Jigsaw was pretty cool. Good twist to it as well. But we got the signature. This is her as Supergirl, but still, it's pretty cool. So three signatures, three different autographs. Two from Prince, and then one from an actual actress. Also got our inserts. Uh, the band box, Laura Vander Voort, uh, Smallville signing. Smallville fans rejoice. We are excited to introduce Laura Vander Voort. Now, she's got two O's in the end of her name, so I don't know if it's Vander Voort or if it's just Vander Voort. Some would say, who cares? who played Kara Zor-El, uh, Supergirl, in the series Smallville. Look for the rare photo with Supergirl logo, which would be this one right here. I did not get that one. The T-800 CPU brain chip replica in the brass edition by Dark Matter Props. My CPU is a neural net processor, a learning computer. Dark Matter Props brings us another incredible prop from one of the most powerful microprocessors ever built. All of the battle units deployed by Skynet contain a neural net CPU. Also, a Bambox exclusive Harley Girl fan art legacy art print, legacy collection art print, by artist Nathan Swerdy. Nathan Swerdy did a Harley Quinn pinup girl for us last year, and now we're bringing him back to make a, a print a set. And in introducing the legacy print, this takes an artist and their print from a previous box and makes it a set. As always, look for the Chase variant. Can I see which one would be the Chase variant of the two? They look almost identical to one another. One of these things is not like the others. Oh, I'll well, see this one here says, Arrgh. that might be the only difference. A BAM box exclusive Wakanda fan art collection art print by artist Kyle Willis. Fresh off one of the hottest movies so far for 2018, artist Kyle Willis uses multiple mediums to bring us Wakanda. And look for the Wakanda stamp variant numbered out of 500, which would be this one right here. A Dana Scully and Fox Mulder FBI badge prop replicas. Uh, in one of the longest running science fiction series and network TV history, FBI special agents investigate unexplained mind bending cases known as X Files. From two of your favorite FBI agents comes these prop ID badges. You will get one of them. And I did get Dana Scully. I'm going to have to track down the Fox Mulder, see if I can find it, and then I'll have a pair because I know I've got it, I just don't know where. Also, there was a giveaway. <clears throat> Let me just straighten that up. Win this Tara Strong hand-signed Harley Quinn Pop Funko Pop. She voices Harley in the video game Batman Arkham City. Head over to Community Page to enter the contest. That Community Page link, by the way, is thebambox.com forward slash community. Anything on the back? Oh, yes. It also says this is the BAM February 2018 box. Coming off this February box, we have some exciting things coming up in the next few months. Let's start with March. You will be seeing randomly inserted signed Funko Pops and toys in the March boxes. And we are doing something for the first time. Over the next three months, the art print is going to combine to create a full print set. Collect all three to have the entire print. All will be signed and will help us count down to Avengers Infinity War. And check out these themes we have lined up for this month. Uh, that would be for, I guess, the March, which would be Avengers Infinity War, Spaceballs, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Ghostbusters, Star Wars, and more. Doesn't say that, but I added and more. That comes to us from Adam MacArthur, CEO of Bambox. This was the BAM box for February 2018. Let me know down below, guys, in the comments section what you think is the best item inside this month's box. If you also have wanted to subscribe to the BAM box, I'll put the necessary details down below. But there's your link on the side, www.thebambox.com. Couldn't be simpler. It couldn't be simpler. Speaking of simple as well, if you haven't also had a chance to hit that little subscribe button, it's right, it's like right there. A little further down not quite in the video a little further down there's a little box that says subscribe 
If you haven't already subscribed, hit that little subscribe button. You'll never miss a beat when it comes to future videos. And yes, bunkos, muchachos, there are going to be many, many more videos coming your way. Just a onslaught of new videos all coming to this channel. So keep your eyes peeled. Ooh, that's such a gross, ah, oh, that's such a gross saying. More videos to follow, guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time.